Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Even though we know that currently Apple does not allow you to run any application in the background, uh, sometimes bits of that application, even after you've exited it, uh, will stay in memory, and this will deplete your resources. Apple doesn't give you an easy way of clearing that memory. I mean, yes, you can restart your iPhone, you can force quit applications, or even easier, you can download and install this application called Free Memory. It's available right now in the iTunes App Store. If you head to go.tagjag.com slash free memory, that will take you directly to where you can download your own copy of free memory. And yes, look at this. I even get a list of the background processes that are currently running on my iPhone. And uh, the current version, this is going to change in future versions, uh, allows me to see the battery level by percentage. There we go. This is, this is the most important part of this application right there. It says how much memory I have free right now. Now this is an issue, especially uh, since most applications expect to have approximately 20 megabytes of memory available to them. If you ever run an app and uh, it crashed on you right away, it may have been because there wasn't enough free memory. Or some apps will tell you, make sure you restart your iPhone before you run this app. No more, as long as you have free memory. Press the free memory button, and in a second or two, you have your 20 megabytes free. Now here's the thing. If you try to free memory when you're over the 20 megabyte threshold, it'll say, hey, you already have more than 20 megabytes available. You do not need to free anymore. That's fine. Oh wait, it's 19. I'm gonna press free memory again. There we go. <sighs> Hopefully you're not like checking this every other you know minute. But the idea is, again, if you go and launch a few apps, and I know the iPhone may not feel sluggish to you, but especially before you go to run a game uh, or you know you want to make sure everything is cleared out, uh, just run the free memory app. I mean, it takes a couple seconds, that's all. And in fact, if you want, oh, look, see that? Just launching the app. There we go, 22. And of course, there's more information explaining uh, you know, how all this works uh, and if you want to read more about how it works. But the bottom line is, you want to download free memory to clear your iPhone's memory. Go.tagjag.com slash free memory will take you directly to the link where you can download this right now. Got to thank Sui Monster for making the recommendation. He said, hey, you got to get this. It really works. I was like, what? Are you kidding? Is this for real? Well, it's available in the iTunes App Store. So apparently it passed the review process uh, and it seems to work quite well. Why Apple did not bundle this utility with the iPhone is kind of beyond me. Why that's not a setting somewhere, it's kind of crazy. So until they do, free memory is it. My email address is chris at perillo.com. Maybe you have other iPhone or iPod Touch tips to pass along. Uh, if you're a technology enthusiast like the rest of us, well, then you're more than welcome to join us in our community of geeks at geeks.perillo.com. If you, you know, feel like interacting with us socially, you're also welcome to stop by the chat room. It's part of this live video feed that we've got broadcasting out over the internet 24 hours a day, seven days a week at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.